Over in Springfield, we're told the COVID vaccination rate is about 43 percent, but in communities of color, it's even lower. That's why an effort is underway right now to get this population vaccinated. Western Mass News reporter Leon Purvis joins us now live from a special vax clinic at the Mason Square Apartments. Leon? Yeah, Jordan, Chris, the Black Springfield COVID-19 coalition is going directly into neighborhoods to get people vaccinated. I'm told they're shooting for 25 doses today. So far, they've given out at least 12. So we know uh, that the city of Springfield is somewhere around 43 percent in the black and Latinx communities, those rates are in the 30s. And Springfield Health and Human Services Commissioner Helen Colton Harris telling Washer Mass News COVID vaccination rates in the city's black and Latino communities in Springfield have her concerned. This especially since cases in the city have shot up to 155 in the past four days, more than double from last week. That is the reason I believe we're seeing an increase. The low vaccination rates in the city of Springfield, the misinformation that is out there, and individuals not taking advantage of the uh, opportunity. Happening on Thursday, a vaccine clinic specifically targeting people of color, hosted at the Mason Square Apartments at Indian Motorcycle, put together by the Black Springfield COVID-19 Coalition. State Representative Bud Williams heads up the coalition. I asked him directly why this population is not getting vaccinated. The rollout was terrible. You roll out a vaccine, you put up at East Fieldmont, which is five miles from here, and you say, come get online, which no computer access. It's a whole array of things. Williams tells us what he thinks will get the vaccine rates up in the city. The answer is doing what we do messaging, uh, trusted voices, folks getting in the community and taking the vaccines to individuals. Now the vaccine clinic here wraps up at seven tonight, so there's still time to come down and get your shot. Live in Springfield, Leon Purvis, Western Mass News.